A-29B Super Tucano aircraft to Philippines for delivery this year ends. Brazilian Air Force pilots will be flying the ordered close air support CAS A-29B Super Tucano aircraft to Philippines for delivery. Embraer will deliver the first of six Super Tucano light attack planes earlier ordered by PAF before the year ends said Inquirer.net Francis Mangosing who attended the Air Force Symposium AFS 2019 on June 4. The rest will be in 2020 and will be flown by Brazilian Air Force pilots, she added. In 2017, the Department of National Defense TND solicited Brazil-based Embraer to supply six CAS aircraft for PAF. Embraer said the A-29 Super Tucano is a durable, versatile and powerful turboprop aircraft capable of carrying out a wide range of missions even operating from unimproved runways. The Super Tucano is the best light attack aircraft in the market and we are confident that it will accomplish with excellence the missions it was selected for. Jackson Schneider, President and CEO of Embraer Defense and Security said in 2017, General Characteristics Crew, Pilot Plus One Navigator Payload, 1,500 kg Length, 11.38 meters Wingspan, 11.14 meters Height, 3.97 meters empty weight 3200 kg 7055 pounds max takeoff weight 5400 kg 11905 pounds power plant 1 Pratt and Whitney Canada 6A 68C turboprop 1196 kilowatts propellers Hartzell 5 blade constant speed fully feathering reversible pitch propeller maximum speed 590 km per hour cruise speed 520 km per hour range 721,330 km combat radius 550 km it can carries a variety of missiles air to air air to ground general purpose bombs incendiary bombs cluster bombs precision guided bombs the philippines considered the acquisition of six super tucano aircraft to replace the aging philippine air force ov-10 bronco the department of national defense reported that a total of six embraer emb 314 super tucanos will be acquired for php 4.968 billion the department of national defense signing a contract with Embraer for six Super Tucano aircraft with options for more. The A-29 Super Tucano carries a wide variety of weapons, including precision-guided munitions, and was designed to be a low-cost system operated in low-threat environments.